So when you knuckle up with H, just know he played for kings And when he hit you on the button with that overhand run I bet you don't remember nothing, he ended your whole night The Twitter man's coming, running to make sure you all right But when Hanks is in the ring, then it's all on side And I knew I could beat him. I still, I know I can beat a lot of guys in there. And I kept telling that to my friends. I said, oh, I can beat that guy. He's kind of a bum. And finally, sure enough, I got pushed into everything by my friends. And as soon as I started training for it, I loved it. And now it's just a matter of time before I get my chance to prove to everybody that I can beat all those guys. Doing the ring, I want to come in as a, as a heavyweight that it breaks the boundaries. You see a lot of big, out of shape heavyweights out there, and I want to be different than that. I want to be the athletic one, the, the one that can go the distance, but at the same time, that can finish it explosively at any time during the fight. Flying knees, spinning kicks, Superman punches, and at the same time, if it goes to the ground, I'm running rubber guard, Eddie Bravo stuff. Uh, I'm going to tap people out with crazy stuff that you only see from the little guys. That's, that's what I'm here to do, and I just want to learn and, and grow as a fighter and show these fans that it, it's not all about the smaller fighters. It's, the big guys can, uh, can make exciting fights again, too. My name is Mike Hayes. I'm a freestyle fighter out of Kirkland, Washington. I want to make the fights exciting. I'll, I'll never quit. I'll fight whoever I have to fight, and I'll give it my all every time. I'll, I'll throw down. That's what I do. Uh, that's what I've always done and I'm going to keep on getting better at it. Uh, I really want the chance to be in the UFC and anything that, uh, that I need to do to get there, that's what I'm going to do. So my first knockout was against a guy on the radio who was talking a lot of trash. Uh, his name was Bikini Dave and uh, yeah, he came in, he was a world-class Olympic wrestler and he didn't like my right hand. <laughs> as soon as I hit him with it, he went down and got back up again. Good for him, but uh, it was just a matter of time and ended up putting him to sleep. I'm really new at this. I've been, uh, I've been training for about a year and a half, um, and right when I started training, I jumped right into fighting. Um, I feel like I've learned a lot in that time, but I'm real raw as a fighter. I, I have a lot that I need to learn with my ground game, a lot that I want to learn standing up. Um, I, I take punches right now, and then I give them back. At some point, I'd like to be able to dodge, duck away from some of those punches and just give it to them. Yeah, I like to stand up. I, I like to throw punches. I like to throw kicks, to throw knees. Um, I'm developing that power. That's, that's what I want to do. That's what the fans want to see. Uh, that's what I want to see. I want to see the other guy lying on the ground, face up towards the sky, uh, going to sleep early.